Hey guys, welcome back. I'm Divinely Destin. Welcome back to another video. This is going to be a general daily message for the sign of Pisces. Pisces, it's a general message. It may or may not resonate for you. You may be from Chicago. Pisces, your name may be Chloe, Billy, Brian, Jonathan, Julian, Julie, Brittany, Christina, David, Jonathan, John, Johnny, Philip, Christy, Christina. You may have dyed your hair black today. You may have uh, also dyed your hair platinum, blonde, I'm seeing. You may be enjoying the first day of April at a spa or the beach. You may be catching up on an old, you know, Harry Potter movie. Or you may be reading a Harry Potter novel. Okay, Pisces, I just pray whatever you're doing, you're healthy, you're sound, and you're okay. I love you guys. God bless. Over our energy. Wow, who broke your heart? Three of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Energy. You may feel left out in a connection that you're in. You feel like your partner doesn't love you or appreciate you, Pisces. Okay, we got the Ten of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Energy. Yeah, you may be married to someone, living with someone, dating, dating someone, and it's just not going well. You feel emotionally abandoned by this person. They're not carrying their weight in the relationship. Okay, we got the Musician, the Magician, Gemini, Virgo, Energy. You're manifesting here. You may be man. You may be manifesting a way out of a relationship. Some of you guys are single, and you're manifesting a husband or a wife or a boyfriend or a girlfriend here. You're manifesting a relationship. You're a powerful manifester. You know how to make things happen. And spirit is saying you got all the tools in your arsenal to make things happen for you, Pisces. If things are not going great in a relationship that you currently have, you have all the tools in your arsenal to manifest a way out of it. You have all the tools available to you to, to make things happen for you. Just hang in there and keep going. Scorpionic energy, the death card. Yes, there's been a massive change to you guys' relationship sector. Some of you guys are unhappy. Some of you guys are in happy relationships. And some of you guys are, are in some relationships that are just not going so well and you're really trying to get out of them. Or you're really thinking about getting out of them or you really want to get out of them. Some of you guys really want a relationship and you really want a family. Okay? You may be a cook, you may be a chef, you may love oatmeal cookies and chocolate milk. You may be cooking today, you may you may work for the Hilton, okay? We got judgment, yeah, a lot of you guys may be dating a Libra, married to a Libra. You've gotten your heart broken by a Libra. You may also work at McDonald's, I'm seeing, okay? Yes, you made some sort of decision that you're going to leave a relationship or you're going to you got to get stronger within a connection that you have with someone. You may be you may be making a decision to try to weather the storm, okay? Push through the bad times, okay? We got the eight of wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, energy. You may have already left a relationship. You may not currently be living with your husband or your wife. Or you, you may have currently, you may currently be at a distance from your partner. There's some sort of communication coming in. I feel like I'm talking to a Pisces that travels a lot. You stay in a lot of different hotels and... You know, long distance connections are very likely here. You and your partner may be doing a lot of chatting online, okay? I'm hearing um, divine masculine, but I'm also hearing private messaging, FaceTime, okay? You guys are doing a lot of computer. You may be a computer software tech. I'm also hearing that. But you may be chatting, you may be chatting a lot online with your partner, okay? Yes. You may also be chatting with a divorce attorney or a... You know, your friends about some sort of separation that you're planning to take here with this person. You may have recently met somebody online and it was a disaster. You guys moved too fast. Okay, it, it turned out to be bad. We got the Wheel of Fortune. Wheel of Fortune. You got the Wheel of Fortune and the Musician. Things are going to be great for you in the month of April. I feel like you have, you have made a decision to leave something behind. Or you're making the decision to try to work harder to make something work with someone here. You may be at a distance from your partner currently. You may be in a long distance relationship, Pisces. And it's just, you want to make it work. You really do. We got the Ace of Coins, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, Energy. Wow. Spirit is like, we got a big blessing for you in the month of April. Or in the next couple of months. There's some blessings coming in. They have been a mess. They have, there have been some massive changes to your financial situation. You may have been struggling quite a bit financially. But I see that there's some financial increase coming in for your future here. And I'm hearing you may be connected to an Aries. Yeah, Aries may be helping you get out of a financial situation. You may be getting a bank loan or you may be getting a mortgage on your house. I'm hearing a mortgage lender. 
I'm hearing trading. So there's a lot of things going on with your energy today, Pisces. But I feel like the universe certainly has some good things in store for you this month. And in the next, in the upcoming few months here, you may just, this may be past energy of a broken heart from a relationship. There's some residual effects of that still in your spirit or your energy. Yeah, most certainly you made a decision to to leave a relationship that it just wasn't working. You made a you made a decision to to actually be in a relationship with a Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius. Okay, you may have made a you may have recently made a decision to move in with your partner, or you're thinking about moving in with them. You guys are talking about it a lot online. Okay, you guys are talking a lot. Cancerian energy. This may be a Cancerian here. Mm. You may your your partner may be a paramedic, a first responder. You may be taking some CNA training classes, Pisces. You may be uh, emergency, uh, what is that called? Emergency room doctor here. You may work in an emergency room at a local hospital. You may also be a paramedic, a physician, or your partner may be. This person is making some sort of decision to come see you, Pisces. I see that. Or they're making some sort of decision to leave you. Or you've made some decision to leave this first responder here. Or if they don't have to be a first responder. It just may it may it just may be a relationship that just you just made a decision to leave it, okay? This person may have a nervous stutter, or you may. Yep, you may just made a decision to leave it. Queen of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, energy. We have the nine of swords, uh, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, energy. And we got the page, the knight of coins. There's been a slow mover offer that's been coming into you from the universe, Pisces, point blank period. This may be a job opportunity. This may be some sort of financial increase. It's been slow. You've been stressed out. You've been worried about it, but it's actually on the way. It's going to happen. Don't stress yourself out about anything in the month of April because there's a financial breakthrough and a financial blessing coming your way. I am definitely feel like I'm talking to a Pisces that has two or three jobs. You work quite extensively. You may have recently come out of a relationship where you were totally financially dependent upon your partner and you don't know how you're going to make it. Spirit says, don't you worry about nothing because you got everything available to you in your arsenal to make it. And if you don't have anything, you don't feel like you currently have anything in your arsenal to help you make it, there's going to be some divine guidance that's going to help you make it. Okay, it's going to help you make it. You may be a teacher. You may be going back to school. You may be a law professor. Okay, your favorite colors may be blue and yellow here. Yeah, you may be connected certainly to a Taurus. Taurus or Virgo, Okay. Empress energy, Taurus, <laughs> Virgo energy. Yes, this person says, I love you. You know, they love you. I'm um, hearing the word Taurus. They love you, Pisces. But for whatever reasons, for some of you guys, you just ended out a relationship. It just didn't work out. For some of you guys, you got a relationship on the horizon. Some of you guys, you got financial e increases coming in, okay, for the month of April. Some of you guys are very single. Some of you guys have been praying for a spouse for a while. You, some of you guys suffer from crippling anxiety, depression. You may be on antidepressants. We got Libra Energy, the Two of Swords. You may be dating multiple people. You don't know who you're going to choose. You may have been secretly dating multiple people, Pisces, and you got caught. Okay, somebody found out. And, and they're the one that's devastated by you. They're the one that's hurt, okay? We got the Eight of Cups. They're the one that left you. Wow, we got the Page of Swords. Somebody watching you, Pisces. They watching. I'm hearing you are watching someone as well. Someone feel like you're stalking them. Okay, we got the seven of coins, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. There's a lot of money in your energy, in your reading, Pisces, a lot of money. I feel like, I feel like, uh, yeah, you may have won some money in a breakup, a lawsuit, some sort of settlement, even a lottery. And that could also happen in the next couple of months, okay? I'm hearing all the way up to December. There's a potential here for you guys to come into a financial windfall. Pisces, we got the five of wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, energy. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, you may have been arguing and fighting with another woman online about your husband or your boyfriend or someone else has been fighting over you. We got the page of wands. Expect some communication, I'm telling you. Expect some sort of communication about a financial opportunity that's coming your way. Financial breakthrough. That dream, that dream job, that goal that you've been planning and, and praying for is actually going, it's actually going to manifest for you. We got the two, two of coins. There's so much coins. You got Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo in your chart, Pisces. Go look it up. Go look up your birth chart if you're not sure. 
situation. Yeah, if someone feels like you were juggling them with someone else and they found you out and they left you. Or you found out that you were connected to someone that had um, multiple lovers and you left them. Okay, there's too much juggling. Somebody's trying to watch you and have a whole house and have a whole family besides you. What they do that at? What they do that at? The Knight of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Energy. Yeah, someone is saying you 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 watch them, Pisces. This this person, your ex, they're they're saying that you watch them, you stalk them. Okay, you come over to the house and announce, you follow them. Okay, Pisces, if that's not there, if that's not you, that's what you're saying about someone else. We got the world. Yeah, some some is certainly ended. Yep, some is certainly ended between the Pisces and someone else. Okay, Pisces may have found out that their person had another person. This may be a Taurus. Taurus Pisces connection here. Yes, expect some sort of breakthrough in terms of your love as well because a lot of you guys have been praying for spouses and husbands, wives, wives. Okay, some of you guys have been praying to get married. Some of you guys have been praying for to be able to conceive. Okay, in the month of uh, I'm here in the month of August, in the month of, of September as well. Wow, you guys may conceive in the month of September. Your baby may be due and you may have a child in the month of September. But the month of April, some of you guys are going to actually meet someone okay or you may have recently met someone and spirit is saying yes this is a high level soulmate connection i love you god bless